the Lord of Tides, the thrice-crowned king, the bandit prince of Melaglir. He forged from blood a sword of sin to cut and rend and sear. From hardened hearts his people wept, tears to flood from stone unbroken, the long-forgotten truth unspoken. Welcome to Mel Aglir. After all this, I'm grateful to be alive and uneaten. It was lucky that you showed up when you did. I must say, I'm impressed, Neophyte. Few of your rank would be able to handle a necromancer of Morkin's power. I will remain behind, attend to the village. You should report to Savant Engar as quickly as you can. Goodbye, then. Good day. So, a necromancer was behind Melaglia's disappearing villagers. Disturbing. My suspicions regarding you potential were well-founded. You are forthwith promoted to the rank of docent. As a docent, your first order of business is to the west, to speak with a man named Anker Edmure. You are to liaise with a man named Anker Edmure a rather enthusiastic sagecrafter from the village of Emea to the west. He often sends reports of mystical occurrences that usually turn out to be exaggerated tales of inebriated fever dreams. His latest cry for help, however, may hold some truth. Go to Emea, speak to the man, and find out what he means by Shardfall has come alive. Oh, goodbye then. Lovely day, isn't it? You're with the Scolia Arcana, are you not? I'm so very honored to make your acquaintance. I know what I wrote was vague. At, at first, I, I didn't know what I was dealing with. It's just... Shardfall. It's changed.
Shardfall is a cave to the west and north. It's a good place to harvest shards, uh, hence the name. The place always has a bit of a chill, but recently the cave became cold, and it howls like it's angry. Many days past, my assistant, Donald Cutty, delved into the cave to collect samples. He never returned. I had no choice. The cold of the cave is too great. Not six steps in, my boots froze to the very rock. That's why I've been devising a talisman to stay warm. The work is almost complete, too. I just need one last thing. Will you aid me? Perhaps together we can solve this mystery. After I failed to make it deeper into Shardfall than just a few steps, I put up a barrier. No need to have some poor fool stumble in there by mistake. The barrier will let you through if you have an amulet that can keep you warm. Like one made from a Bargast's heart. A Paragon Bargast, that'll do just fine. I've heard of one ranging north of a mare. If you can kill it, fetch me its heart, and I will be able to complete my pendant. I'll be here. her music to the countryside of marbled ruin. The plains birthed the gentle grass. Listless streams meandered through the verdant hills and babbled of their gentle travel to the face of the windswept cliffs. Thus the symphony of Arathel began. Unbarkest. Incredibly tough creatures they are. Give me a moment. There, take it. You're better suited to plumbing the depths of Shardfall than I. You can now brave the cold to investigate exactly what's happening. Years ago, I read a treatise from Savant Hadris Llewellyn that suggested frost magic was particularly potent there, but I never gave it much thought. All I really know is something dark is happening within. Be cautious. I'll be here. 